Hi, my name is Sundas and I am an analytical lead at Google. My role is turning data into powerful stories that influences business decisions. I have an untraditional background where I have a six year gap between my uh, high school and my college career. Um, so for me, when I was trying to start all over again, so I started at a community college. That was my first exposure to online learning. And it was perfect because like I was managing kids at home. So at Google, we talk a lot about imposter syndrome and I personally relate to it quite a bit. Being the first female in my family to graduate university and also being an immigrant, a lot of the times I'm surrounded by people who do not look like me. For example, there was one time where I was presenting to senior leaders in my in my org and I was so nervous presenting to them. I was like, this, I'm going to totally blow this up and they're going to figure out that I'm just a totally a fraud and fake. One of the things that I changed is that even though I was the only female in my team, I started networking. I started expanding my network and I met a lot of women who are from the country where I am from um, and they were also immigrant. They also struggled with English. And they also looked like me and they were doing very well in their career. They were being successful. So when I looked at them, I was like, okay, if they can do it, then so can I. So that was for me, was a very a big confidence boost to kind of like get over that imposter syndrome feeling. But like I struggle from it day to day. Like I'm struggling with it right now, standing in front of you. Do, like, do I even deserve to be like talking about my journey and my skills? So it's completely normal. There are a few things that I like to do. One is that I like to give myself a pep talk. Like pep talk definitely works. Like just saying like you're totally worth it. You you deserve it. It like does wonders for me personally. The second thing I like to do is um, I like to keep a log of my success and failures. So when I am um, at a down point, when I'm feeling down or I'm feeling like a, uh, feeling like I do not belong here, I look at all the things that I have achieved. Um, from that log and that kind of helps me that's a good reminder of the hard work that I put in to kind of get here so I did not get here to because of luck I got here because I worked hard and um, I earned it my family is actually really really proud of me um, uh, after seeing me go to school and graduate with two kids my younger brother he actually went to school with two kids as well and he graduated he finished his master's program and my sister-in-law, who also had two kids and she was managing it, and after seeing me that I could do it, they had somebody to look up to. And so my sister-in-law went back to school and she uh, finished her degree as well. So I think just being the first in my family was really hard because I didn't have anybody to look up to. But now I am that person that people in my family can look up to, specifically girls, and they can pursue whatever they put their minds to. Congratulations on finishing this video from the Google Data Analytics Certificate. Access the full experience, including job search help, and start to earn the official certificate by clicking the icon or the link in the description. Watch the next video in the course by clicking here. And subscribe to our channel for more from upcoming Google Career Certificates.